It is noteworthy that the DN could have fundamentally different values and policy positions. Now, here's the kicker, and I think this is the most interesting part of the statement because you've just sort of like rolled a hand grenade into the room and, and, and walked away laughing. It is also noteworthy that August travel accommodation and entertainment claims while a member of the legislature are the subject of an internal investigation. So, boom. You know, so you're saying that this guy, you're alleging that he fraudulently uh, misrepresented his travel accommodation entertainment claims and basically stole taxpayers' money by being reimbursed from the public purse. Yes. I'm saying it, and a reason I say it is because I think it does create a, um, a hand grenade for the DA because they just expelled Masizol in Tesela mm -hmm. for the same thing. Mm -hmm. um, and um, we were alerted to the fact that the Western Cape Provincial Parliament, the Secretary of Parliament and the Finance Department or the Members Affairs Department were investigating a claim for Human Rights Day constituency event. Um, now, we didn't have a Human Rights Day event as a party, but he claimed travel, he, tra he claimed entertainment expenses for a Human Rights Day event. Um, and um, the Western Cape Provincial Parliament informed our office that they're investigating it. Um, and then there was an anonymous um, uh, tip off that he also claimed for other. Um, events. So when he was at by-elections, uh, he claimed for accommodation and stuff. So there is an investigation being done by the Western Cape Provincial Parliament into his claims and whether they're fraudulent or not. Um, and if they are, then the DA have recruited someone that they've that has committed the same misconduct that they fired that that they used to fire the Speaker of, of the of their own party of the of the of the legislature. Yeah. So the the provincial legislature, the DA controlled provincial legislature, is investigating this. I thought it was the statement internal investigation, but if the legislature is investigating this, that's huge. Yeah, by internal I meant, and maybe it's not so clear in the statement that internal to the Western Cape Provincial Parliament, because we didn't we don't pay out the claims and the. I mean, as a member of the provincial parliament, you are entitled to what is called an enabling allowance, mm -hmm. and it allows you to claim back expenses that are incurred in the official conduct of your duty. So when I was a member of the provincial legislature and I had to go to, I don't know, uh, Saldana Bay to do something, I could claim the mileage and I could claim if I stayed overnight for the hotel and I could claim my meals. Um, and so um, that would be legitimate claims if I was there on official business but not um, to take your wife on a motorcycle around the peninsula and claim it as a constituency meeting. D did he do that? That's the case that's oh. been investigated. Yeah. Wow. The man likes his entertainment, let's put it that way.